Hi all, welcome to the Salesforce Ultimate Guide channel. In this video, we are going to uh, continue with our trigger exploration. So we have this scenario, question number 21. If opportunity stage is updated upon its creation or updated, then update the description as either opportunity is closed lost or opportunity is closed one or opportunity is open. Okay. So uh, to understand this more, I will just show it on the UI. Let us say we have opportunities. Okay. And then in this one, we have like stage. Okay. And within this, if we are selecting closed one on the description, we have to uh, write like a yeah, opportunity is closed one. Okay. If we have selected a opportunity closed lost, then the description should get updated that opportunity is closed lost. And apart from these two, if anything is selected out of this, no, we need to populate this with uh description with uh opposite is open opposite is open okay so to achieve this functionality uh first uh this should work in insert as well as update part so first we will uh implement it for update part later we will modify the code to uh, work for even insert part okay to start with this uh we since we are working with only one object this will be in the before context so we'll just start writing the code First twenty one on the first This is right now I'm writing for a before update. And then if trigger dot is before and trigger dot is update. So we will start with our for loop opportunity opp on trigger dot new okay then uh now we have to put the condition okay so how we will put the condition first we need to think uh, what we what on which change we need to implement this okay right now they have mentioned that uh whenever the uh stage is changed stage is updated no then we have to put it on the description okay so to check that so opp dot stage name so if we go to here opportunity opportunity object there is stage name okay and this stage name i'm going to use it here stage name uh, is not equal to now we need to compare whether it got updated or not so to fetch the old value we are using trigger dot old map dot get out so we have to pass some id so that will be opposite dot id then the field which we want to um, compare so that is stage name So th this particular check will uh, like Azure uh, assert us that the particular stage name got changed. It got updated. Then in that case, uh, what we need to do is we need to implement this uh, opportunity is closed, lost, closed one or opportunity is open. So that we can use uh, using one more if condition. If opacity dot stage name current value so i'm comparing with opacity dot stage name is equal to equal to we need to come check the values available okay so what are the values available closed one okay i'm writing same closed one if this is the value then we are keeping opacity dot description field so description field as Opportunity is closed one. Opportunity is this is I'm storing in the description field. Okay, if this condition doesn't match, so you'll see if opportunity dot stage name is 
equal to equal to now second value is closed lost so closed lost is case closed lost is the pick list value so we have to write the same thing here closed lost in that case as well opacity dot description i'm going to store it as opportunity is closed lost okay if these two both condition doesn't match then finally in the else condition am i going to store first dot description is equal to so what they have mentioned is opacity is open Opposite description, opposite is open. Okay. Uh, so after this, uh, we will try to run this first. Um, new opportunity. Close date 17. Stage name right now. I'm giving closed one. Uh, sorry, some other thing. Then I'm going to save this first. In the details, we can see that right now opposite is open. Uh, then if we go and modify it again, um, where is the thing? One second. Yep, and where is the stage name? Okay, it's here. So I'm going to change it to closed one. Here we can see that opposite is closed one. I am again now if I update it again, closed lost and save it. So opposite is closed lost. So like all of our conditions are met. If opposite is stage updated upon its creation or update, then update the description as either opposite closed lost or opposite is closed one or opposite is open. Okay. So all the three conditions are met and the only it's like almost same simple only so we just comparing the existing value with the word value and uh, we are writing if else if conditions so that uh, if it is matching with closed one closed lost if it is not matching with both of them what we want to store in the description field so this is the working of this particular trigger uh so if you guys have understood and uh, uh like this video please click the like button on the video and share with your friends Thank you so much.